Hey guys, so today I wanted to talk about how you can make yourself a little bit more successful, motivated, and healthy. And I thought that maybe um, these three categorizations could be fit into the tips that I'm giving just because the tips here seem to cover those bases. The first thing I would say from the get go is when you wake up in the morning, you, you definitely want to make sure that you know how to like energize yourself because people can wake up groggy and stuff and you know of course I've been there and it's a normal thing but what would set you apart to make you more successful or motivated which is the most important part I think of the morning is to have a routine that really gets you going for the rest of the day that sets your mind some key habits that I've used are I guess running going outside it exposes me to the Sun like I'm exposed right now for God's sake I gotta rain my face it gets you that vitamin D and then of course taking a cold shower is really good that just like really gets your heart rate going. I would say also maybe in like the first five to 10 minute start of your day, just grab your phone or something or whatever, listen to or watch a motivational speech. I'm telling you guys, this really helps, especially in the morning when your mind is a little bit more impressionable and your mind isn't really as clouded as it might be later in the day. You know, it's uh, new and fresh and recharged. So, and also when it comes to waking up, try to wake up early. Of course you want to get like the right amount of sleep and stuff, but waking up like early enough, I'm talking really early, like 6 a.m. or something, can really help. The world hasn't really woken up yet, at least on your side of the world. You have a lot of time to yourself to think and to strategize for the rest of the day which is actually my next tip, which is to say that you want to schedule your day, right? Not only is it important to like make a to-do list as far as, you know, the tasks you want to carry out, but you want to time it, right? So like, let's say you want to clean your desk, uh, make a YouTube video, maybe work on your lawn or something and then before you go to work or something, right? Each of those tasks you could maybe parse out into two hour intervals and that should cover you for the day. And now that segues into, I think, the fact that you should have like a clean space, like a kind of clean room, at least for me, in my subconscious, when I, I when I have a very cluttered space, it uh, it's quite distracting, it can be anyways. I think that should help, and I don't think it's a bad thing actually to do uh, in the morning. It's like kind of like a nice morning routine to set up, just like clean up what you have cluttered the day prior, you know what I'm saying? That's something that could be really therapeutic actually, uh, if you just do it by yourself in the morning or, or whatever. and. Uh, some I love doing. Another thing I wanted to mention is that affirmations are really important. It's one thing to say that like you don't want to eat junk food all day or you won't stay inside, for example. But I think the opposite of that, saying the opposite of that is just, like a little bit more important, which is to say that like you want to stress what you will do, not what you won't. So, for example, I've been on, you know, the NoFap journey for a while and I've talked about that in several videos prior. Uh, but I never say to myself every day, like, I'm not gonna fap, I'm not gonna fap. I don't say any of that. I just say, like, I'm going to do something else, right? That I just hold more importance to the affirmations of what I think are important. Like, I will make a video, or I will go outside, or I will, like, have a green juice today, something like that, you know what I'm saying? Now, I think one of the most important parts of this video is if you wanna be successful, motivated, and healthy, I think you have to have self-awareness. And this is something I can't really teach you guys, but I can say that this goes into like listening to your body. So uh, let's say for example, if you're super tired, or you know, if you feel lethargic throughout each day, fatigued, you know, there's a reason for it. And so I would argue to like try and figure out what the root cause of that is, whether that's um, by means of you going to your doctor or you know, uh, searching something on the internet that you think would help do that you know do that don't don't sit around and do nothing I, th I think that's uh, that's the key man because I think to have like a proper foundation for any of the tips I suggested here you need to first be healthy you need to be healthy I think that's it for this video I really hope you guys enjoyed I haven't done a video like this in a while I've just been posting vlogs because uh, I love doing that I'll have another vlog probably coming out pretty soon I hope you guys enjoyed take what you can from this video and I'll see you around all right guys